So I have been on the hunt for the perfect silicone crock pot liner um, and haven't quite come across it yet. This one's close. Um, I like that it is stiff. So I have these, which are more like the bag liners, um, but they are huge for this crock pot and they get wrinkles in them, just like the bag liners do. I don't know if you've ever used bag liners, but that's basically what they do. I liked this one because it's stiff and I was assuming it would fit my crock pot pretty much perfectly. Uh, but as you can see, we're not quite perfect. So we have a big bump here. Um, I don't know how that's going to affect cooking. I'll find out here in a little bit because I'm about to make a meal in it. One of the things that I do like about this is that I had bought some split um, liners that uh, were okay, but a lot of time, a lot of the um, condensation would go down between them, and I would have to clean out the crock pot. Anyways, um, they actually fit into this. So if I do decide that I wanna do a split meal, I can certainly just put these inside this liner as well. Um, or I could probably, well, I don't know how that would work if I did just one of them. Um, but I'm gonna use just this tonight. So then the other issue that I can see might be an issue with this, I like the tabs. It's really important to have these tabs to be able to pull this liner out when your food is hot. Um, but it doesn't, I don't know if you can see, it doesn't quite sit flush with the edge of the crock pot canister, the crock pot um, dish. So when I put the lid on, I can't get the lid all the way down. So the lid does sit on top of the hard, um, on top of the hard liner, the silicone liner, but you can see right here, pull back a little bit. This is that little bump. So I don't know how this is gonna affect cooking. We will try this tonight. We'll see uh, if it works and I will leave my review after.